Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. Maybe it was just the geek in me, but you said Picard. I thought Captain Picard. I thought Star Trek. <laughs> well, it's all very futuristic, right? Yeah. Just kind of weaves together. Drought Monitor, the latest one, came out today. And look at this. Just a small sliver of far western Oklahoma in moderate drought. The rest of the state, not technically in drought. These areas in yellow are considered abnormally dry. So the rain that we've had recently really helping to alleviate our drought situation. Next seven days, more abundant rainfall on the way. We're hoping we don't get too much. Remember last May, we had record rainfalls across the state of Oklahoma. So far, this is looking A-OK -okay now as we get into the middle to almost the second half of the month. And speaking of the second half of the month, all right, first half of the month, we didn't do too bad. This was the forecast that we posted back in April. We had those warm days. We had the storms that led up to the ninth. And now we've had a little bit of mild weather and we'll go back into some rain and cooler temperatures Sunday through uh, Monday and Tuesday with rain. Then it'll dry back out for the 18th, 19th. Another storm showing up around the 20th to the 22nd. Then we're warm again and then another storm 25th, 26th. Memorial Day weekend looking pretty nice right now with sunshine. A storm is close by by the 30th to 31st. It may be delayed and hold off until June 1st. So we might have a beautiful Memorial Day holiday weekend. It's shaping up like that right now. So let's hope that trend continues. Tomorrow morning, a chilly start at the bus stops. So we'll need those jackets, sweatshirts once again, but we won't need them in the afternoon. Beautiful day tomorrow. Then tomorrow night, if you're out at Rooster Days in Broken Arrow, we do have some rain that shoots through here at about 10 to 11 o'clock, and that scoots on by down to the south. Maybe a rumble of thunder, but no severe weather. Cloud cover Saturday afternoon, but most of the day Saturday now is dry. So you can do whatever you want without worry of rain. I think the rain's out of here by Saturday uh, morning, especially. Then Sunday, we'll have some light rain returning in the afternoon. High temperatures, I think, are still going to be stuck in the 50s on Sunday. Right now, we're looking at clear skies, 68 degrees. The winds are calm and uh, the dew point right now at 49. So some very dry air in place and it is comfortable. Forecast then for overnight tonight, Starlet, 54 at 3 a.m. By 7 a.m., 53, so cool morning, but a great middle part of the day up to 79. Fantastic afternoon. Temperatures tomorrow in the lower 80s, Bartlesville, 84. Prior around 83, we'll see highs at Muskogee of 83 with a southwest breeze at 10 to 20 miles an hour. And McAllister hits 84 with those southwest winds at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Watch out for the rain at Rooster Days tomorrow night. Otherwise, nice evening for that event as it's uh, underway about 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon and 83 the temperature. Then 83 or for all of us tomorrow, 66 on Saturday, 50% chance of rain is there Sunday, just 59 behind that strong cold front. And they were kind of up and down, but coming out of it with some pretty nice weather, middle of the latter part of next week. Wow, 49, throw an extra blanket on the bed.